Hey and welcome back to the channel. Today in this video, I will show you guys how you guys can generate free AI images using the Flux model. And then later in the video, I'm also going to show you how you guys can generate the consistent characters as well. And when you watch this video until the end, I will share a bonus tip how you guys can convert consistent character image to a consistent character video, all for free. Now, with that said, let's get started with the first option, which is to actually generate the image. And we are going to use this option which is also by the way completely for free and this one is called MLE Chat Mistral. You guys can simply sign up to this website by using the link in the video description below. The easiest way to sign up and to create an account is to use the Google account. Now once you are signed up and logged in into the account you will see the image or the screen which looks something like this. Now once you're here I highly suggest that you guys generate the prompt for the image which you want to generate. Here I will ask the MLE chat for let's say an image prompt for a 25 year old guy on a surfboard. So just like this and hopefully right now the mistral.ai will come up with the image prompt and here you guys can also already see the prompt. Now once you have the prompt it's the very easiest step is to just copy it just like so and then down below you'll find a button called image generation. Now if you click on it you can just simply copy this prompt with the button right here and then you will get the message text copied to clipboard right here in the bottom right corner and here just paste this prompt inside. So just like so I will delete the rest of the text so we only have the prompt right here and when the input field looks like this with your own prompt of course you can simply click on the arrow right here and hopefully the mistral.ai will come up with the image. Now of course you can generate plenty of the images using this tool and it's all completely free. By the way if you guys are enjoying this type of content make sure that you smash up the like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Now here we already have the result so this is the image if you want and if you aren't happy with the actual result you can simply click on this arrows right here and it will regenerate the another image using the same prompt as well. Now this is more like it. I think that this image looks way better than the one before. Now once you have the image which you are happy with you can simply click here on download button and you should get the image saved on your computer. Then the next part is that you generate the consistent character. Now how can you do that is to navigate to this website which I will also put in the video description below right below the like button by the way. Now here you can see that this is basically the flux model and this one is completely free to use. Make sure that you create an account for this website so huggingface.co and uh, here you can also see that we have here usage quota so with the account you get about zero GPU which is five minutes per day I think and then we also have other stuff as well like private storage as well as inference API. Now once you are here you can pretty much scroll down and here you'll find plenty of the presets. So for example let's go with this one which is portrait side view and if you click on it here you will see here the image and the generated image as well. Now what you'll have to do here is to simply click on the X button right here and click on here to drop your image. Now here I will select the image which we got from the leechat.com so let's go here to my finder and let's click on the image which I think is this one. Click on open and you can also see here the preview of the image and then here down below you'll see the options which which are important like width and also the height. Now for the width I will go with just with the 1270 by 7 24 the height and that is pretty much it. Now you can also see here the seed and uh, every other setting here as well like the prompt which we used from the actual template. So the prompt is very simple portrait and side view and right now this model should generate a consistent character and it should be very similar to this original image. Now once you're here click on generate and uh, you can scroll up here and you can see here that this will take 34 seconds to generate 
and uh, I will get back to you guys when this is actually finished. Okay, so here we have the consistent character image. I think it looks okay. We also have the site view here, as we said here in the prompt. And now we can also download it if you want to. And uh, one thing which I'll also do here is to generate one more image. For example, I will go with this template right here. So portrait Pixar. And here I will upload the image once again. So I will click here and click on the image, which we got from the Lee chat. And now we have here a different prompt, of course, we don't have the side view, but we have here the Pixar and also portrait mode. Now for the width and the height, I will leave it as it is. And now we can simply click on generate one more time. And now here we have the another result, this time in the Pixar style. Now you can simply click on download the image as well. And now the next part is to use another website on hoggingface.co. And this one is called Pure and Lightning ID Customization. Now here you can see this simple parameter where it says a single ID image is usually sufficient, you can also supplement with additionally auxiliary images. Now, for example, if you go here under the ID image, which is the main one, you can click on it and here make sure that you upload the image which you got from the previous Flux model. So this one right here. Now, once you have the image uploaded, you can also add additional auxiliary images as well. So if you click on here, you can, for example, search for the another image, which is this one right here here and right now we already have the two of the images. Now make sure that you also change the height and the width. I will go with a width of 1280 by 720 so just like so and then for the mode you can see here you can pick for example extremely style or fidelity. I will just go with the fidelity and now down below you also have some of the prompts. So one thing which I'll do here I will change the prompt here to portrait and cinematic. So here I will just remove everything here so just like so and that is pretty much it you can also take a look here for example at the zero gpu usage i have right now two minutes of use and i only have three minutes left so here i will just click on generate and hopefully we will get very similar customized image here you can already see four of the images i think that the results are okay however you can also see here that on the first image we have the guy with a beard and on the second one it doesn't have the beard so i think that the results actually look kind of fine and of course the main image here is this one right here where the guy has the longer longer hair compared to this second one which is the, just the auxiliary image now here we can see four of the images i think that lo they look okay and you can for example click on one of the images and download them just like so and then click on the next one and also download it as well. Now, once you have the consistent characters, I highly suggest that you guys also go to the video description below, like this video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Now, the last step as a bonus tip, I will also show you how you guys can also convert the consistent character right here to the video. Now, I will use this tool, which is called Hyluo AI, and it's also, by the way, free to use. However, it uses the credit system. So if you click here on this shell, you can see here that you get daily bonus credits which is 100 so make sure that you use them carefully however you can also always upgrade to the premium account and then you will get much more of the credits now once you are here on this website click simply here on the create button and then make sure that you go here under the images and upload the consistent character image i will just go with this first one and uh, this is pretty much it for the prompt i will go here to the lead chat I will copy this prompt right here, which is for the image, and uh, I will uncheck this option. And uh, I will ask Lee Chat to generate a video prompt from this description. So just like so, click on enter. And right now, the Lee Chat should give us the prompt for the video. So you can also see here how it looks like. I will just take this main scene prompt here. So I'll just copy it just like so. Go to this video AI tool and I will paste the prompt right here. Now for the model, you have here two models. You can pick from this one and this one, which is brand new. And uh, I think I will just go here with this brand new one. Now for the quantity, you can also increase that to whatever the credits allows you to do. I will go just with one here. And now I'll click on this shell. This took 
more than expected. I actually had to wait 40 minutes to generate the single video on this platform. So yeah, make sure that you, for example, if you want more faster generations on this platform, make sure that you upgrade to the premium account. However, then if you have a free account, you'll have to unfortunately wait for quite a bit of minutes to generate a single video. So yeah, the result I think looks okay for the free video and uh, overall I'm quite happy with the video as well. Now with that said, I think this is pretty much it. I will leave every single tool I mentioned in this video linked below in the video description. Guys, if you haven't already, make sure that you leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel as well. And with that said, have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you all around in the next video. Peace.